Welcome to the Master Wong TV. On this lesson here, I will go forward you onto the Wing Chun Level 2 Basic Training. On this Level 2 Training, you need a partner to work with. Without the partner, you won't be able to use the energy drill to stimulate through the reality training, so we won't be able to help you onto Level 3 Training. Everything you need to learn for close quarter, you need someone to play with, because that's what you're going to fight with somebody. That's why, so the energy drill will stimulate through this for you. This lesson, I will go forward you on to the kick to the thigh, to the leg here, to understanding how each one works. So we're going to start with a drop kick into the leg and then go from there. Let me, uh, if you've got partner there already, bring them in and then we can start playing. Let me bother your gym. Now, as you remember, when you're doing all the punch roll, learn the punch roll already on this line here. Yeah? When you're understanding, understanding all this basic thing, that will become your home. Learn about grabbing. Soon as grab, that's a drop kick, land like that onto the fire here, okay? Very basic and simple. Grab this one here, it's slightly, the shin one, you flick, you pull like this. This one here, you drop, you push from there. You push, boom, like in here, okay? Make sure the equipment gone. That's why we can able to do that. The idea, learning to understanding the line, is drop, chain, control, grab, and then kick. When you kick on this one here, like I mentioned before, is push it in like that, okay? The leg push in like that from here. Make sure it's in balance here. Hands up right like that. Don't bring down here, push in that, force into me. Then we're going to have problem. The way you have the hand here, that's where they are. Don't put too much force into that because you're going to force the elbow toward me, okay? So make sure the hand is in here, leave it there, force the elbow in. It's hard because I'm controlling that lower below the leg. So all this training, you need to remember and understand. Gradually, as you go and move along, I will explain to you one step at a time to helping you to understand. If you comment on the training, I will, it will help us to helping you later on. If you do, then that's no problem. We're there to try to help you as much as we can. Okay, the idea is learning to understanding is that up here, the energy drill, it belongs to your home now. Here, you haven't got a problem here. So this is where you're understanding the line of it. Each one you come in here, you work, you control, your line, the body in line. This is important to work, to understand, basic, okay? Very simple movement. Cross, grab, kick. Very simple. Just practice with this to control the line. Technique have to be good when you're working first, so you can understand them and able to make them functional for you, okay? So that is, is important. Trying to spend a little bit of time to play with this, to get your leg functional, so you can pick the kick up and use them anytime and all the time if you need to. Without learning this and understand your leg and move and pop in and out quickly enough, you will become very difficult when you're working on the hand here, and then the leg have to do the work at the same time. So you have to spend some time practice. This is how we're gonna do it faster on here, so they can understand the line. So when you're understanding this, when your hand here, you feel you're gonna work right away. Yeah, line, feel, you work straight away like this, okay? You change the hand, feel, boom, hand like that. Same thing in here, when you work, boom, come back to the tool here, and then line, boom, okay, thank you. So what you got to understanding is, everything you do, you have to do slowly. First, learn on static. Secondly, moving slowly. And thirdly, you've got to make the movement functional. Happen and react on things after you're working with them. A lot of time, you've got to spend it, practice on yourself to get the balance first when you start to work. Without all this balancing, you won't be able to put the kick on and create a lot of power. And that becomes very important in the close range. Close range, you need power. Power to do it in a very short distance. So it's important to exercise them well. Spend a little time, if you're on your own, practice the balance. If you've got a partner there, put the equipment on, practice some kick. Every lesson, I need to thank everyone out there, helping us, all of you, helping us to make all this happen daily. Every time I have to thank you all for that. Because without you, we won't be able to be here to filming this, to helping everyone else's. So I thank you on their behalf. Play safe. I will see you again on to the Master Wong TV.